welcome back to Auto Repair guys, thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. If you guys have a vehicle, a car and your oil light is on guys, that red oil light, okay, that's the light I'm talking about. Stay with us guys and we'll show you what causes that and what are the most common reasons why that uh, oil light is on and how to fix it. Now, we we'll guys have more than 200 videos on every single vehicle we get at the shop. Why guys? Because our mission is to save you as much money as we can. So, please guys, okay, please uh, subscribe to the channel, okay, like the video and drop a comment below and we'll guys try to add as many videos as we can. You can see we're constantly adding more cars. So, if you guys have your oil light on, what that means guys? Okay, it means that the car, okay, is either not building enough oil pressure or there is something wrong with the car reading the uh, oil, oil pressure and uh, getting the actual data. So, that little guy here guys, this is an oil pressure sensor, also known as oil pressure switch. Okay, that oil pressure sensor, okay, it's usually on the box somewhere guys. Uh, on the box on a, or an oil cooler next to the oil filter somewhere and this uh, oil pressure sensor detects what the actual oil pressure is on the vehicle if that guy is bad guys what will happen okay it's going to send a signal to the com car computer and say hey I'm not getting oil pressure so turn the light on even though your engine may be fine your oil pump is fine okay that little thing may uh, may cause your light to come on and as a result guys you may think that the oil pump is out but it's not it could be just that oil pressure sensor there is a way to test those and we have the video on the channel so please check it out now there is also a simple way to test them with a computer without even removing those things and we'll have the video as well but if that sensor is good okay it's not bad what else could be causing the problem in our case guys okay let me show you where that sensor goes to okay it's on the engine block Okay, right here. You can see that's the hole there. And there is only one wire connected to the oil pressure sensor. Okay, this is the wire right here. If this wire, guys, is bad, okay, if sometimes you come loose, or you hit a bump or something, the car is not going to read the oil pressure and the light will be on. Also, often, guys, that, that wire is next to the exhaust. Okay, like in our case, and it could melt, okay, if somebody worked on the vehicle and didn't uh, use the, the correct clamps or zip ties to secure the wire, it can touch the exhaust, burn, and you may not get uh, oil pressure sent to the computer and as a result the light will be on. So those are guys the best scenarios. What else it could be wrong? It could be guys a bad oil pump. You don't want that thing to happen. Why? Because in most cases guys you have to take quite a few things apart you have to take the engine apart to replace the oil pump, you have to remove timing chain or timing belt depending which one you have to get to the oil pump. So you hope guys that it's not an oil pump. Now if it's an oil pump guys and you stop your vehicle immediately after the light turn on, you most likely didn't cause any damage to the engine. But if you ran your engine for uh, some time after the light came on, Okay, it means that the engine was not getting oil and as a result guys you may throw a bearing like a connecting rod or main bearing even you can damage your head so uh, that could be something catastrophic guys and you end up getting a new engine so if you see that light on immediately guys stop at a safe location turn the engine off and fix the problem okay before you ruin your engine and let's say the pump is working, the, the pressure switch, all that is good as well guys, the wire is good. What else could be activating your light? It means that the engine is not getting enough oil pressure, which could be uh, due to a wore out connecting rod bearing or piston uh, or a main bearing, excuse me. And as a result guys, okay, you're going to get that light on. Or it could be just because you're low on oil and the car is not getting oil to the oil pump so all those reasons guys but always guys the most common one is okay this guy right here this is the most common reason why you will get an oil light light on on your dash so hopefully the video will be helpful guys please hit that subscribe button for more videos and see you guys next time